I'm making this call directly to the governments of Pakistan and Turkey. It is time that Pakistani and Turkish Air Force join hands together and establish a no-fly zone over Gaza. Any Israeli aircraft that is attacking the civilian population, any Israeli naval ship that is bombarding Gaza, or any Israeli artillery gun position which is shelling the civilian population must be destroyed from air by Pakistani and Turkish Air Forces. When the Mavi Marmara incident had happened a few years ago, when a Turkish relief ship to Gaza was intercepted by the Israeli Defense Forces, and ship was seized and many Turks were martyred. At that time, Turkish and Israeli Air Force had flown against each other and both countries had almost come to war. Do, many, not many people do not know that Pakistan Air Force was also flying alongside, wing to wing, with the Turkish Air Force against the Israelis. It was this joint threat from Pakistan and Turkey which forced Israel to back down and they released the ship and the tensions were subdued. But now the time has come that we repeat this joint collaboration to save the Palestinian Muslims of Gaza. Israel is committing war crimes. World can no longer just sit and watch this genocide. This must be stopped. Israel does not have the capacity to fight Pakistan and Turkish Air Force combined. This is the time. This is the moment to rise. Otherwise, the history will not forgive the Muslim leadership of today. They must participate. They must contribute the military strength that they have to defend Al-Aqsa, to defend Gaza, to destroy Israel. The time has come. I'm directly talking to Prime Minister Imran Khan and President Erdogan. Let this moment be a moment of your glory. The moment you rise to defend this Ummah. It is time to physically threaten the illegitimate Zionist entity of Israel. May God be with you. May Allah be with you. And may you be the 